Alright, we got another zealot run by coming into the same base. Liberators seem like they're going to siege up on the opposite side of the map for new meta. Oh, he's floating to another base. This is not the way. He's going to fly right over the main. I think he might have thought he was going in from the other angle. What is this? Look at that. They all went to one spot and separated at once. This is beautiful. That was a thing of beauty. Look at these things doing work. Oh, we can get all four of them in the shot, too. Oh, no, we can't. One over here. That one's gone. This one's still going. 39 workers, 40 workers, 42. More liberators, and the tanks are here with the Raven, the Thors. New meta executing these multi prong attacks with the harass is just absolutely chef's kiss. Tanks are here. He needs to take out the main army of Moor, and he will be ahead forever in this game with the 47 workers that have fallen. Tanks shelling away at these expensive robo units and stalkers rather decently. And uh, I do think that new meta is going to do this. Uh, take us to game five. Tanks are moving forward. A couple still here in the back for zoning out. And they are going to start doing such. Needs to resiege the remaining tanks. More walking into the line of tanks. Oh no, only two disruptors and immortal four stalkers in the Colossus remain. Nothing in the production tab. 1900 minerals, 2300 in the gas. More needs to get something produced. He feedbacks the medevacs and the, um, sorry, the ravens and I think the medevac was maybe still there. No, the medevacs over here. Meanwhile, still shilling away at all the production. Everything going is new meta. He's got massive army leads seizing up on the stalkers, hidden in the corner. So many tanks, so many liberators. You can't fight here. This is a siege zone. Holy shit, look at this stuff blow up from all the massive mech units. More tanks are here. Two more rubbers. GG is called. That was fucking crazy way to end the game. Holy shit. That was, yeah. that was fucking hot.